I'm joined by Dan Potter, who's the VP for Product Marketing at Click. Dan, great to see you. Thanks for joining me. Great to be here, Des. Thank you. You've had some exciting news to uh, add to the market. I wonder if you could tell us about your announcement. Oh, it's been great. We, we announced uh, the connector factory at Click, and it's our goal to help organizations unlock all the value of data across any system that they have. And the challenge is great. You know, the, the challenge not only with unlocking from databases, and there's hundreds of databases, it's been a prolific you know, growth of, of different uh, databases, but also SaaS applications, thousands of SaaS applications. And this is where all the data that you need for your data engineering projects and your analytics initiatives, you got to unlock this data, you got to move this data, you got to shape this data. And the connector factory is really our strategy to double down on, you know, we've got a couple hundred connectors today we literally need to have a thousand connectors to solve all the myriad of challenges and systems that, that our customers have. So this is our way of, of helping to address those needs. Fantastic. And when we were talking offline uh, earlier, you mentioned that uh, you know we all track it through DB Engine. And in yeah. the last couple of years, we've seen it going from like 90 classic databases to over 300, so forth. Yeah. One of the big questions that people have with this is, is this a niche fit or is it across all industries, all groups? Oh, it's across all, 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 there's a lot of niche applications, but the core databases apply to all different industries. Uh, the core SaaS applications, there's probably 100 to 200 SaaS applications that most large enterprises use or need. Uh, think about the, the proliferation of, uh, of marketing uh, and sales applications. The MarTech stack is just, it's, it's huge. So, uh, you know, our strategy is to, to try to knock off the, the databases and applications that most of our customers would need, but also address those niche uh, applications that are critical. And there's a lot of them. And also legacy applications. You may have a legacy application on-prem where you've got uh, an API, a, a REST API interface to, and the only way you can get data from that application is through that API. We have a technology now that enables us to very quickly unlock that data, map that data, and move it into Click Cloud for analytics or move it into your cloud warehouse or data lake. Fantastic. From an integration point of view, just very briefly, uh, when we were talking offline earlier, you mentioned this is actually just another element. It's a pull-down menu. This is not an adjunct or a side element. This is actually built straight into the platform. Yeah, this is a strategy that's going to provide immediate benefit to uh, organizations that are using us for data integration, for analytics, for application automation. It's kind of a core foundational piece to, to what Click does. Uh, and we think it's going to give significant uh, advantage to our customers. Fantastic. Well, congratulations on the announcement. It's very exciting. I cannot wait to see where this mm -hmm. goes. Uh, very, very briefly before we wrap up, where can people get more information from, about this? Uh, if you go to click.com, you'll see the press release. There's uh, links to other information. Uh, and, and of course, you can follow us on our social channels. Uh, lots of great information, including a, a video that explains uh, our strategy around this. Fantastic. We'll make sure there's links on all the social posts that go with this. Dan, congratulations. Really exciting to see the, uh, the, the Connector Factory come out from Click and uh, be fully integrated. And uh, we'll look forward to more information as it's coming available. Thank you, Des.